Hello ladies and gents, welcome to beautiful Cape Town. I hope you enjoy this background and of course the exercise as well. We'll get ready to the front part of our mat. We'll stand straight in Tadasana. You can close your eyes, focus on your posture. Notice if your spine is nice and long. One last cycle of breaths. And now I want you to start rolling your shoulders forward and back. Alright, now interlace your fingers behind and open your chest, squeeze the shoulder blades closer together, maybe look up a little bit, breathe into your lungs and absorb the energy. Okay, release your arms, lift them all the way up, inhale, lengthen, exhale, tilt to the left, stretch the whole right side. Inhale back to the center, lengthen and exhale, bend to the other side. Inhale back to the center, arms go down. Inhale, arms go back up. Exhale, forward fold. Slightly bend your knees, grab your opposite elbows and start swaying from side to side, nice and easy, long deep breaths, try to lengthen the spine again. Well done, release the palms on the floor, inhale, straight back and exhale, palms on the floor, step or jump to plank. Inhale, exhale, Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog. Let's stay here for a moment. And with exhalation, downward facing dog. Walk out your feet since it's our first downward dog. Take it nice and easy. Slow, walk it out. now finally move to stable downward dog now I want you to lift your right leg up now bend your knee and point the knee towards the sky open the right hip and do four circles with our knee that's one two three and four now move your right leg behind you to the right your right arm lifts up your chest open and your hips are pushing up 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 well done palm goes back on the floor three-legged dog now your right foot goes underneath to the left side and you lift up the left arm, open the chest. Palm goes back on the floor, free like a dog. Lead your knee under your chest, hold for a sec and land your foot between the palms. Let's stay here and just adjust yourself so you have nice stability lift up to high lunge arms up exhale go lower and elbows together inhale up and down up and down two more times And now put your palms back on the floor, lengthen the spine, make it straight, move to pyramid pose. Inhale, back forward, straight spine, exhale, pyramid. 
Breathe in, back down, look forward and breathe out to pyramid. Last time, breathe in and breathe out. Let's stay here for a moment. I just want you to flex your right foot as much as you can. Make the right leg active. All right, bend the knee, go forward once again. And now step to plank, chorus active. And we go front and back. Front and back, front and back, front and back, front and back, and a little bit more. Nice movement for the ankles and our feet. Okay. Exhale, Chaturanga. Inhale, Upward Dog. And exhale, Downward Dog. Okay, you can again walk out your feet if you need to, pedal them out and get stable now. And we'll repeat on the other side. So left leg goes up, three-legged dog, open the left hip, four circles, two, three, and four. Now just land the foot behind you so you're opening to the left side lifting left arm up opening the chest and hips up okay palm goes back on the floor free like a dog and now move your left foot below your body and opening the right arm Right palm back on the floor, three-legged dog. And move your knee in front of your chest. And now land your foot with control between the palms. High lunge. Arms up. And as we did before, inhale. And with exhalation down, squeezing the elbows up down breathe in breathe out let's stop here palms on the floor and as we did before look forward straight spine exhale pyramid inhale down and forward straight back exhale pyramid Two more times like this. And stay here with our left foot flexed, trying to go even deeper into the hamstring. Okay, let's go back down, bend the left knee, but this time we open the right foot out to Skandasana and we'll simply move from side to side, warm up our hips. And now let's stay with our left knee bent, bind behind around the knee and behind your lower back and look up to the right slowly release and let's repeat on the other side so right knee bending and wrap the arm around the right knee left arm behind looking up opening the left shoulder
well done let's go back to the center to prasarita padutasana so maybe you can adjust your uh, width between your feet depending on how flexible you are so you can almost reach with your head on the floor and now I just want you to walk your arms between the legs and making this 90 degree angle now walk your palms to the middle left palm stays in the middle right arm goes up right shoulder opening switch the palms left arm goes to the sky left shoulder opening nice twist okay palms back on the floor move your legs a little bit closer to each other goddess pose your toes are facing out as well as your knees and you're trying to open them as much as possible and just feel the connection with the earth maybe we, you can sway a little bit from side to side to ease the hip tension well done now spread your arms wide and move to warrior two so let's start with the right knee bent move to warrior one hips facing forward and now enter paribrita trikonasana so that means right leg is straight left arm is from the right side of the right foot and the right arm is facing up if you can't manage to um, pass the left arm all the way to the right then just simply keep it more in the middle all right let's lift back up to warrior one back to warrior two back to prasarita padatasana and move to the left warrior two warrior one now slowly move to paribrita trikonasana again so right arm passes from the outside of the left foot left arm facing up this is a very demanding asana so don't worry if you're struggling just try your best and let's slowly exit back to warrior one and now step right foot next to the left chair pose and now all the way down to forward fold grab your shins from behind maintain the touch between your belly and your thighs and try to straighten the legs as much as possible breathe hold here exit the fold back to chair pose and all the way to tadasana palms in front of the chest and with this i'd like to say goodbye i hope you enjoyed this beautiful environment and i'm looking forward to see you 
next time. Namaste.